<laughs> Today you went heavy man. Wanaume tunapitia mingi hapa hivi. Today you went tunapitia mingi sana. Heavy. Can you imagine sending a woman ma- monthly 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 upkeep? And you're not even sure whether yes. you you know you do, you do Because when she started talking Salika's mom, Salika is my daughter. Uh-huh. Telling her about she used to get really mad. She used to tell me go deal with this shit or I will leave. Go deal with this or I will leave. I hate this woman calling me all the time. All the time. And abusing her and yes. telling her this yes. that the other. Yes. Well, you know what? Mm. Sometimes it's good to just let it all out mm. and you've done that. Nine years later. Wow. Ha! My turn. A story a day. Wow, Jalas, I'm telling you, man, that that that, that was heavy. That's <laughs> heavy for a Monday. <laughs> so <laughs> that must have been one of the lowest moments of your life. Very low. It it bugs me up to today. Yeah. I can't lie to you. Mm. Up to today. Ah man. Yeah. You know, you know, I would tell I would tell young women out there. But you know what? If you have a man or you're planning to have a baby mm-hmm. with a man in the pretense that you know you'll get the upkeep and get money and extort money from them for upkeep. Mm-hmm. You understand? Today you might have a job, tomorrow you might not. But a pregnancy and a child is something permanent. Do not use your baby as a trap out there. To Ab- extort someone. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yes. You know, it reminds me of uh, something it's very similar that happened to me. Mm. Someone trying to extort you or hold you ransom. Mm. So, uh, and this was at the height, height of my uh, career at CNN. At no, CNN. Yes, we'd done this Niger Delta story. I'm sure you, you, you read about it in the yes, book. Yes, in the book. Which was the most amazing story. And I, if I had a chance to do it again, I wouldn't change a thing. You know, we had gone down. I had researched this story for more than a year. Gotten in touch with those rebels down there. They gave us permission. We flew down there. And we were deep in the mangrove swamps doing this story about the... Yes, they this this amazing men. photo of you uh, with the... But, uh, with the with the army behind you yes right? yes with dreads the rebels yeah, and everything yeah, yeah. yes so uh, we get down there and uh we, you know with no security it was just myself a cameraman and a photographer three of us going deep into the swamps for, for uh, to interview mend the movement for the emancipation of the niger delta and we did an incredible story jalas and, and uh, while there i uh, discovered there were th- uh, 32 Filipino hostages who had been kidnapped by these men rebels because they used to kidnap, uh, demand ransom from the companies, get the money, buy arms or feed themselves or whatever. You know, that, that was their modus operandi. They wouldn't kill per se unless, you know, situations got ugly and a few uh, expatriates did get killed down there. But for the most part, all they wanted to do was uh, hold them for ransom, get the money and, 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 you know, to feed this rebel movement. And we did that story. It aired on CNN day, hour after hour after hour. It was an incredible, it looked like a Hollywood uh, movie. Blockbuster. In fact, it looked so much Hollywood that the Nigerian government said that we had staged managed the whole thing, including the Filipinos. We had, you know, uh, rented actors. These were Hollywood actors, these guys, because they looked like nothing you had ever seen. And firing weapons, 50 caliber weapons off a speedboat, you know, the Nigerian Navy didn't even have that kind of stuff. So it was a huge story. What? I'm telling you. And it was top. I mean, my name was just up there. Jeff Coinage. As we, <laughs> we go live to Jeff Coinage. So anyway, it was around the same time, uh, you know, a rumor started. Oh, uh, yeah. Rumors started circulating that uh, some woman in Europe who had been in touch with me at some point, you know, you get a lot of mail from people. And you get in touch, get in touch, and you, you communicate with the person. And then they say, look, I hear you're a good friend of Oprah Winfrey's. I'd really like to meet Oprah just to promote a book that I'm writing. And I said, look, Oprah is my friend, yes, but it's not that kind of friend where I just introduce people who I don't know. You know, mm. she's, she's like a busy sometimes woman. Sometimes when I try to introduce people to you, yes. and you're like, Jalango, oh. really? <laughs> Who are this? Who, who is this? Uh, uh, how? Or when they wait for you out here? Uh, every, morning every morning outside the gate. So then, you know, pushing, pushing. I want to meet Oprah. I want to have a book because Oprah has a huge book club. And when Oprah pr- uh, promotes a book, you know it's going to be a bestseller. You know a million people are going to buy it. That's how she, powerful she is. 
and you know i wasn't convinced about this and and i kept saying look she's not that kind of friend she says oh but i've seen pictures of you oh i've seen you hanging out with her you seem to be good friends i said no it's not that kind we just, i did a story and she appreciated it and you know <clears throat> we are that you know we are mm. that that's, that's at that point can i add something yes i don't decide on guests that will go on jkl we are not that <laughs> kind of friends <laughs> So you people out there who always oh nitengene say niende ongea na Jeff no 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 just like Jeff and Oprah are just friends correct we are also just friends <laughs> you can't push a guest to come on wow so anyway it came to that point she became a stalker just like your stalker oh i'm going to do this i'm going to expose you oh you know there's all kinds of crap through the mails through mails that you uh, uh, and then one day she, Uh, she wrote a story she used to write a lot of she had her own blog and she wrote a story that i had attempted to rape her and you know with rape it's always one person's word against another right and for the most part it's Gosh. women's uh, so, actions that are yeah. believed more than men and by the time you undo what's been done it takes forever and it went and in the, you know of course her, her, her this is after you guys have met sometime no never met Never met. Never met. It was always male, just male. Never met. So now she's conjuring stories. And it went all the way to my boss in Atlanta. So CNN. I'm, yes. So I'm driving on the highway now. I've had a great day in the office. I'm driving home from work. Uh, and I'm told, uh, I get a phone call. I'm told, hey, Jeff, would you pull off the highway? Uh, where are you? I said, I'm in the car. I'm on the highway. There's traffic. He says, would you pull off the highway? I said, oh, is this urgent? I mean, am I going on another story? Is this urgent? Just pull off on the highway. and the, the boss says listen man it's just too much crap the nigerians think you'd stage manage that story now there's all these kinds of rumors coming out you know i don't think we we can we can uh, sustain you much longer we're going to have to let you go just like that you're at the height of your career nothing can go wrong and then you're hit with this boom and i have a baby coming in 2 months imagine that so you are sucked on the highway heading through home. a phone call phone call and then he says oh, but don't worry uh you know we'll we'll pay out your salary for the rest of your contract so you'll be sorted but you know we just want to sever this relationship and they didn't bother even to find out investigate you know double check and you know in the in the business of double checking none of that It was just too much pressure from too many uh, areas. Angles. So everybody was talking about this. Everybody. But then at the same time even within uh, this a lot of jealousies when you are at the top man. Who is this guy who's suddenly risen to the top and he's getting all the big stories? Oh, he's done Katrina, he's done this, he's done that. Winning awards left, right and center. So that PhD syndrome, you know, pull him or her down. I've experienced it. But the most important thing was not letting it get to you, which is difficult. I mean, it's easier said than yeah, done. Because uh, when you're you, family and you're top, I mean, you're mm. in the Premier League. You're you're messy, and then you're cut down and told, "Okay, sort yourself out." Wow! So people think you know they look at you and they think, "Oh, you've just you've just you've been a st- you, you became an overnight star, or you don't go through problems like they do." What when afikiri wana mashida there's an accusation of rape can you imagine man? and uh, sometimes it comes up still up yeah, to once it, yes someone will bring it up and say oh won't you accuse without you know using one reference you know without use you know, without getting the story they just they just pick you back on that one one uh, allegation can you imagine and that thing and you know rape is not uh, i i did stories about rape in the congo remember i told you yes, about yes. the hospital there went to in eastern congo yeah, where there was one, one doctor one doctor for 700 women between the ages of 7 and 70 you doing a story about rape on how you want to help people can you only for you to be accused, accused of one the irony the irony jealous horrific so I mean, they let you go they let me go so you came to the office picked your stuff Uh, yeah left the car the company car all that's the ids you know uh, there's a whole process signing out from signing cnn out walking away no more this is cnn and that is a, a story, story a day, day.
Join the world of Viewsasa Entertainment and enjoy the videos you love. SMS the word Viewsasa to 40984. Choose your preferred package plan. Select the amount for your chosen package plan, then click Next. Viewsasa, connecting you to the videos you love. A story a day, only on Hot 96.